how did you decide how many solar panels to have installed and how many are you getting? Okay, we contacted the solar shop who were brilliant. They came out, they did a site visit, they looked at the site, they identified the nursery shed as being the best position for the panels and they recommend 40 of the 60 watt um, panels to be installed, which is what happened. Solar panels are photovoltaic cells. They work when irradiant sunlight hits the silicon constructed panels and creates direct current, for example, DC. This can be compared to the photosynthesis of plants. The panels being installed at the nursery are monocrystalline, which is a thin silicone wafer and is more effective in partial shading and more flexible. This generation of panels has a higher temperature tolerance than their predecessors. Photovoltaic cells were first developed by NASA to be used as a form of energy in space. When the sunlight hits the cell, a portion of the light is absorbed within the semiconductor material. The cells also have one or more electrical fields that act on moving the electrons in a certain direction. The placement of metal contacts at the top and bottom of the cell allows electricity to be drawn out to use externally. The power needs to go through an inverter system to be changed into an AC sine wave form of electricity. Due to the financial incentives for the installation and resale of the solar energy, solar energy panel sales have gone up in the last two years. Why did you decide to have the solar panels installed? Okay, our main aim was to reduce the running costs, obviously, um, insulation in the nursery, which will provide a better environment for the working, um, for the volunteers and so on. You've been out there, especially in this warm weather. Um, so the benefits are there. And also um, best practice sustainability. How did you get the grant for the solar panels? Yep, we applied with the federal government, their photovoltaic rebate program, and we were lucky enough to get $12,000 towards the installation. We want to provide or be an example to the community about being eco-efficient in the workplace and also reducing our ecological footprint.